Three of Swords is here. Six of Pentacles is here. Something came back. Six of Pentacles is very giving, very kind, equal give and take. You were kind hearted to someone. You were um, giving to someone. And um, something happened to the point where they did something to you. And um, they wanted you to be heartbroken. They wanted you to be stressed out. They wanted you to be depressed, going through heartache. And it's like, that, that's coming back around. Six of Pentacles, equal give and take. Whatever you do come back on you tenfold, good or bad. So whatever energy they put out towards you, they're getting hit with that. The Wheel of Fortune is here. It's like, this was destined to happen as you started walking in your destiny and your purpose. Your Wheel of Fortune, your calling. The Wheel is only going to turn in your favor. Whoever is sending negative energy your way is on immediately going to, you know, go back. This is the karmic wheel. These are people that did this or this person did this in the midst of divine time. And it was destined to happen that way. Yeah, two of wands is here. They wanted you to be at a stalemate. They didn't want you to walk in your destiny. They didn't want you to walk in your calling or your purpose. They thought this would have you being at a stalemate, not knowing which way to go in life. So they could have been under the impression that you were doing one thing. And then they tried to put a standstill to that. They didn't know that you would be doing other things. You could have been doing with the Six of Pentacles, six other things that they didn't even know about. They were too focused on the one thing that they wanted you to be at a standstill about. Not knowing how to make a you know, proper decision about it. And they planned this out. Yeah, Three of Cups is here. This could have been somebody that you were celebrating with. You could have been kicking it with this person. This could have been a friend of yours. People, somebody that was close to you. Could have been three different individuals. These could have been third party individuals that you don't even know. And it's like they kind of got together, gathered up at this Three of Cups. And had them set back and planned out to have you at a standstill stalemate. Not knowing which way to go in life. This could have been a friend of yours that did this and they got behind the scenes with friends of theirs and did this yeah out of envy hatred jealousy five of swords is here these are people that thought they were going to click up at the three of cups to sabotage you these are people that only sabotage themselves and they didn't know as they were backstabbing you at the two you know uh backstabbing you as this person has two swords in their back they didn't know that they would be left at this three of swords heart broke, stressed out, because you were only giving to these people, equal with these people, kind-hearted, sharing with these people. Whatever they had did to you, it's coming back around. Whatever you had to do for them, it's coming back around. And they didn't know. They're at a standstill, two of wands, not knowing which way to go. Queen of Swords is here. These are people that are envious of how intelligent you are. Who you are as a person. How sharp you are with people. As you haven't been through a lot. It's like you're straightforward. You speak the truth to people. Cut off things that no longer serve purpose. This is stuff that people cannot do. These could be people that's all they do is sit back and click up with people and party and kick it. And be hating and jealous on every, you know, of everybody else. And it's like they see you on this chariot moving forward. And you haven't cut these people off or cut this person off, Queen of Swords. Spoke the truth to this person. And they were left at the Three of Swords heart broke. Stressed out and depressed because they could no longer play in your energy. They could no longer get behind the scenes, Three of Cups, celebrating and kicking it with people that you don't even know. And being hateful and envious and jealous of you. Wanting to secretly sabotage you. As you haven't cut these people off, left them at the Two of Wands not knowing which way to go. They didn't know that they would get that six of pentacles equal give and take. Whatever you do come back on you tenfold. Whatever you had and did for them in a positive way is coming back on you tenfold. And that's why you're having good luck. As you walk in your destiny and in your purpose. The will of fortune. The will is only turning in your favor. And karma is being issued out to these people that wanted you to be at the three of swords heartbroken. 
These people that have backstabbed you out of hate, envy, and jealousy for no apparent reason because you were on this chariot after gaining truth and clarity. Four of Wands is here. And then the Sun card is here. As this almost popped out in the reverse, so somebody didn't want you to be happy. They didn't want you to get in another, another relationship and be happy. They could have been in a relationship. People could have looked at them as, oh, this person have a stable foundation. This person have a happy home life. But in reality, this person was in a relationship and they weren't happy. So they could have seen you part get in a relationship for wands. And they seen you, you know, at the sun card, being content, being happy with that person. And they thought they would get behind the scenes and try to sabotage you or sabotage their connection. So you wouldn't partner up or get in a relationship with no one and be happy. This person is stuck in a relationship that they don't want to be in and they're not happy. Yeah, and this is what they're going to watch come in for you four of wands and the sun card is here. Whoever this person is that, you know, you're getting ready to get in a relationship with, this person is going to make you happy. You're going to make that person happy. Yeah, Six of Swords and then uh, Queen of Cups is here. It's like you chose to distance yourself from different people. You chose to distance yourself from this person. This could be someone that's at a distance that did this. They wanted to have you distant. This person, whoever this person is, is somebody that you didn't do nothing but show love to. You were someone that was very, um, you know, kind hearted to this person. Very loving, very caring, very giving. If you had kids with this person, you took care of your kids. This person wanted, you distanced yourself from this person. It's could have been a baby father or a baby mother. And they got mad. Because they seen you get, they knew that if you got another relationship with someone else, they would be happy. You would be happy. So this person thought they would do something to try to have you, um, you know, distant from people. They could have tried to distance you from your kids or something like that. Because they didn't want you to be happy. This person thought they were going to have you at the three of swords heartbroken, just sabotage your life. It did not work. No matter what you had to went through, you had to move forward. You had to move on. You gained wisdom, you gained intelligence, and you kept moving forward. This made you be in this Queen of Swords energy if you were in a situation where you had to fight and stand up and speak the truth to people and cut off things that no longer serve purpose. This just reassured you to move forward and do not look back, sailing away and not even looking back. You were being divinely guided by your ancestors because you were being too kind to people. To giving. And people thought it was sweet. Yeah, Ten of Swords here. They thought it was sweet and that they could just betray you. Backstabbed you. You wouldn't do anything. You're always in this Queen of Cups. Very loving, caring, and forgiving. You'll forgive them again so they can backstab you more. It did not work. You had to stood up in this Queen of Swords energy. and had to sail the way and did not look back. Spoke the truth about people. Cut them off and know because they no longer serve a purpose in your life. And you have to distance yourself from people. These are people that did not know as you had them sailed away. They were at the five of swords sabotaging yourself. You were already gone. You were already on this chariot moving forward in life. Yeah, five of cups. Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. This person is in, somebody is in regret because they didn't work with you. They're in regret because something that they did, it did not work. So they're in, you know, in regret, ashamed, embarrassed, crying over spilled milk. Whatever they did, it did not work. Other people are in regret for not even working with you. Could have been something that you were doing business-wise. As I said, you had six different things that were going on other than what they had to do. 
um, this person is in regret for not wanting to work with you or not working with you or something like that. Or because whatever manipulation and um, trickery did not work. They had the three of swords heart broke. Yeah, nine of wands and then the hermit card is here. Yeah. And then nine of wands. <laughs> it's like... This person is in regret for ghosting you and wanting you to chase them down. Knight of Wands is here. This person could have been in a Knight of Wands energy. Wanting you to chase after them or something like that. This person was under some type of lust for energy. They could have been under a lust spell. They could have tried to play some type of lust spell over you to get you to want to have sex with them. Did not work. Ned and did this over and over again. Nine of Wands is here. Ned and took their self through the same never ending cycle over and over again. This is the type of energy that this person attract. This person was under the impression if they hadn't ghosted you, you would chase them down. Knight of Wands is here. Now they're sitting back nervous. Because you had to move forward and moved on. They're in regret at the five of cups. They haven't sabotaged themselves. Yeah, Knight of Swords is here. They're angry. They're mad. And it's like this person cannot be mad at nobody but their self. They're mad because whatever tactics that they thought they had to use on you did not work. <laughs> Queen of Pentacles is here. Yeah, you started, you're someone that works very hard. It's like you started working on yourself, working on your finances, your stability. And whatever businesses that you had, whatever goals that you had. You were more focused on that. This person did not want to do the work. They're in regret for, um, because something didn't work. It was some type of tricky, um, deceptive tactic. They could have, you know, somebody could have told them, hey, if this person chased you down, you got this person and this and that. And they didn't know they were getting negative advice over and over and over again. Yeah, this person was at the Seven of Swords being very sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes. And it's like they were projecting that energy onto that person to make them look bad. So you could cut that person off. Queen of Swords, that person. Speak the truth to them because they no longer serve purpose in your life. They wanted that person to um, be seen like that in your eyes. Yeah, whoever they were, this person is, whoever this person is that's at the Seven of Swords is the person that's angry. They thought they had to set something up to, um, you know, betray that person. And they're, they're in regret because that didn't work. Whoever this energy is, they're someone that persuade this person to try to ghost you. This person will chase you down and this and that. Now that energy is nervous. Because they had that person under the impression that that's how, what they were supposed to do. This didn't do nothing but make you stand up at the Queen of Swords. Speaking the truth to people. You were already someone that was in this Queen of Swords energy. So it's like this person already knew that. They figure if they would, you know, persuade this person to try to ghost you or something like that, you would cut them off. Yeah, this person is in regret because it didn't work. Get a death card in the reverse. This is something that they could not end. So if they thought they were ending somebody coming towards you, this person that made you have this person was under some type of um, this person was at the Knight of Wands. They were under some type of illusion. They were under the impression that they needed to um, be chased down for love. And they didn't know that was lust. This person didn't know the difference between love and lust. This person didn't know just how much they needed to work on their self before they came towards you. This is somebody that did not, whoever this person is at the Seven of Swords, they didn't want that person to transform with this death card in the reverse. They didn't want something to end. They wanted this person to look bad. This person could have did this in the past. They always gave this person negative advice to make them look bad in front of people that they wanted to connect with. All because they were someone that was envious and jealous. This could have been a friend of theirs. And this could have been, a, you know, somebody that did the same thing to you. You have to just take it where it resonates. And this could be past, present, or near future energy. Could be masculine or feminine energy. We embody both. King of Cups is here. Yeah, they knew this person was in love with you. And it's like, this made this person in love with you more. 
Yeah, King of Cups and then a Death card in reverse. This person do not want something to end. This made this person jump from the Knight of Wands energy to the King of Cups. They realized this person was somebody that was sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes and they were pissed off. They were mad when they found this out. Whoever this energy is is sitting back at the Five of Cups and regret because whatever they had done lied to this person about or try to persuade this person, it did not work. This person felt betrayed, backstabbed, especially when they seen you moving forward. Queen of Cups and then um, the Chariot is here. They seen you moving forward. They were looking at that energy crazy. They were upset for taking that advice from that person that was at the Seven of Swords being sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes. Yeah. This is somebody that wanted to be held in high honor. They wanted to be seen in certain lights that was not their own. They would just give people negative, negative advice. Give that person negative advice just to have control over that person. That person didn't realize that they were getting negative advice from somebody that was at the Five of Swords. Envious, jealous, a hater. Trying to sabotage them. They didn't know. This person is seeing you at the Six of Wands having victory and success. Yeah. You're attracting a lot of attention as well. Two of Pentacles is here. And then Ten of Pentacles is here. It's like this person is going back and they wanted this person to go back and forth in their head about um coming towards you. They knew about this Ten of Pentacles. This is you and this person's Ten of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles. They knew. They wanted this person to go back and forth in their head. Should I go towards that person? Should I not? And this is this person's Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. They didn't want this person to build, you know, a Ten of Pentacles generational wealth. They didn't want this person to come in union with you, knowing that you were their twin. But it's like this person, it all, you know... It all was revealed and this person felt betrayed. They felt like this person had to set them up. As they see you having victory and success by yourself. Six of Wands is here. You're sitting in this Ten of Pentacles by yourself. Creating generational wealth. Building a legacy by yourself. Yeah, they're realizing a friend or somebody that was close to them was envious and jealous of them. They were being very sneaky. Yeah, eight of Cups is here. It's like they walked away from that person. They're not looking back. They walked away from a confused mindset. This person watched you walk away from them. They wanted you to walk away from them because they were envious and jealous of this person coming towards you and building this Ten of Pentacles. Generational wealth. 